everybody, this is Roxy with Dollar Tree Haul, and I am super excited. I got two Dollar Tree gift cards from some of my siblings and sibling-in-law. And so, today we went out for birthday breakfast, and we were down near this humongous Apple Valley Dollar Tree. So, guess where I went after we ate? Um, and I found the coolest little things that I've uh, seen people haul and then some things I haven't seen anybody haul. So first off with the boring stuff, I got more turkey bags. These are great for crock pot lining. Because with the crock pot liners, it's like five bucks. And I think you get two bags in there. So this is two for a dollar and you can't beat that. They work perfectly fine. I came up with this idea on my own, um, in my own little brain, because I thought, well, if you can bake a turkey in the oven in it, it should be just fine for a crock pot, and it is. So if you haven't tried it, it's so much easier. Like if you're making anything, chili, soup, sloppy joes, you know, roasting anything, perfect cleanup. So then Scrubby threw this in. I think he wants it for at his desk, you know, with the ha uh, the, not the holidays, with the cold season coming, he really likes to keep his hands clean. And then, food-wise, I found this. Um, I love macaroni and cheese too much. But I thought I'd give it a try for, you know, Bear Creek. I think it's made in the U.S. Just to be my... Well, it doesn't really say, but... It says Bear Creek Kitchens, Persephone, New Jersey. So it doesn't say where it's if it's made elsewhere. And I think they have to. If it's not made in the US. Anyways, there's that. And then Scrubby also threw this in, and I don't know why, because he doesn't like gummy bears. He might have given it or thrown it in for me. I don't know. I forgot to ask him. And then this is out. I love this. It's so good. I haven't found the Oreo cookies, not Oreo brand, but they're like an Oreo cookie with mint in, and I haven't found any more of those. So hopefully I got an early batch of them, and they're going to still be um, putting them on their shelves. So I got two boxes of those. And then my favorite, um, I got the vanilla cream, but they had peanut butter cream. And these little little Dutch made cookies are really good. And as somebody said, they're all good. So um, got this. I'll try those. And then I also bought these. And I already put them in my little jar, but they're very good. These are moments. Where are they? Columbina moments. They're they're kind of like a Lorna. They're I think they're even better than a Lorna Dune. They're they remind me of um, kind of the uh, Girl Scout. What are they called now? Scotties or whatever. They're the shortbreads. So they're pretty good. If you see them, try them. If you like them. All right. Then I have not seen. These being hauled yet, and they're adorable. Little hand creams. Um, and different flavors. Vanilla. Strawberry and blueberry. And then Panda's Grape. But they're just cute little stocking stuffers. And almond. So those are really cute. Then I found the tissue paper that... I bought the tin, and they didn't have the tissue paper. Now they do. So, and I'm sh I'm thinking you only get about two pieces of it, but I think it'd be cute to um, like decoupage it or mod podge it. Isn't that pretty? It's very cute. So I got that. I got two of those, and then I found some cute tiny little bags. These are really cute. You know what? I'm missing something. Oh, there and then there. No. Where did I 
go. I'm missing some washi tape. Huh. So there's that. There's that. Isn't that cute? And then this one. Got your own Christmas tree. It's really cute. And I thought um, that would be cute for a little 5 by 7 But it also, and look at the little tags that come with it too. Aren't they cute? They match them. But it'd also be cute for, um, we're giving little, there's, you know, in the baby section or the baby, I guess baby section, it's those little dogs. There's like a soap dish. So Scrubby grab a couple of those so we can give something to the neighbors for Sheila or from Sheila. Because they all love Sheila. Everybody loves Sheila. Then I found this for my sister-in-law. She loves this kind of stuff. It's a motion. <laughs> it's supposed to be sensor detected, but motion sensor, but it looks like it just keeps going. And then these are really cute. Some boxes. I love the font and the different designs. And this Santa's really cute. That is really cute. And there's two more, one more. I don't know, maybe I'll just open it and see. So you could see them all. Their artwork is just so good. And it's so many different styles and just really cute. So there's the Santa. There's the tree. And then the word Santa. Okay, so I just went and checked my receipt because I'm missing something. I think Scrubby forgot to bring a bag in from the car. So I'll just do the last couple things I have here. Um, these bags are gorgeous. I have not seen these ever before there, but they're beautiful. Look at that. And the picture of the owl. Oops, I almost knocked you off the counter. A little oh, but look at how gorgeous that is. One side is foiled, and the other side is not. Isn't that beautiful? And then the inside is really pretty, gorgeous. I mean, it's just gorgeous. They really have got some awesome design. Very pretty. I just love it. That would be so beautiful to frame. Or you could even just hang it on a door with tissue paper in it. You know, it'd be pretty. Then I found this one too. The little Mr. Fox. This is a, actually, this is the first one I found. And I didn't look, I found the owl after. And I was going to look and see if there was more. But I thought, you know what? I'd buy them all and I don't need more bags. Isn't that pretty? That's the same interior. And then here's the back, which is so gorgeous. Like, look at the face on that. It's so pretty. Very cool. Then I've got, so excited. Okay. I saw, okay, I asked, Scrubby came and he started kind of nagging. Because he went to a different store and then came back and, I didn't start nagging. He just started kind of like, are you done? I'm like, I'm trying to find this trailer mug. It's a mug that looks like a trailer. And I go, so go see if you can find it. Kind of give him something to do. So he came back and he goes, no. He goes, the guy. I asked the guy and he said if they had them, they'd be over here and he hadn't seen them yet. But he knows they get all kinds of mugs like that, like trucks and stuff. So to come back is they'll probably get them. So I'm like, bummer. I go, where did he show you? And they went over there. And then I saw this girl, she was walking around with these. These are huge. And I'm like, oh, I said, well, at least I'll get one of those. So then we tried to find out where she went with them, and I couldn't find it. So I, we found her, and I said, I go, you know those snowman mugs? I said, but I said, have you seen little trailer mugs? She goes, no, I haven't. 
I said, well, can you show me where the snowman mugs you had went to? She goes, the one with the little nose? And I go, yeah. And so she brought me over there. And the shelf above were all the trailers. There was like 30 trailer mugs. And she had said, she goes, oh, yeah, I've had a few people ask about those. She goes, I just haven't seen them. And I go, I go, well, there's the trailer mugs right there. And she goes, that's a trailer? And I go, yeah. And she goes, oh, gosh. She goes, I thought it was some kind of like a little planter or something. So there's the little trailer mug. Super cute. So I got five of these because I think it'd be cute for like four of them on a, a coffee tree. And then I got two of these. I mean, these I probably, you know, these would be fun for soup or hot cocoa. And I think I'll give one to my niece with hot cocoa and marshmallows and stuff in it. And then, um, you know, maybe, I don't know if I got it. I don't need to keep one because I've got snowman mugs with bigger noses than this. Like, they come out to here. My sister had them, and I was so jealous. I wasn't jealous, but I just was like, they had the cutest mugs, and she goes, I hate these things. I get so nervous that I'm going to break them. Do you want them? I go, yeah. And that was like 12 or 15 years ago. So I still have them because I carefully pack them away. But, um, so this, I, I mean, it's super cute with the tiny nose. The little tiny nose. But, um, so I might, might or might not keep this. I don't know, but for sure, I got four of them and then one for my secret Santa from your paper pantry. And then I'll be back because I know I got another bag somewhere. Maybe I'm just missing it in the house. Oh, there it is. Never mind. I'll be back. All right, so I found the other bag. It was over on the table. I didn't even see it. Um, okay, so look at how gorgeous this artwork is. And, like, I don't need another container or ten, but I just, it's so pretty. I just couldn't pass it by. It's so pretty. Pretty watercolor and collage. I just love it. And I was told I don't need another ten. But I said, well, this one I need. Okay, so then... There's a bunch of solar dancers out, but I've got so many, I thought, you know what, I'm just going to get the one that I think is the cutest. And that's this one with the snowman hanging, or no, what is it, a penguin or snowman? Yeah, snowman hanging up on the light lamppost and the other one dancing or swinging. So that's pretty cute. Then I found this. It's just plastic, but it's... And this comes off, you know, and then it's decorated underneath, if you can see. But this is the same paper. I love this design. So I bought the last haul, I got the tin. I think I mentioned that. So now I've got that. Just something cute to have when you go shopping. I just stocked up on these again because they always seem to disappear. And then I found these are, I bought a couple sets um, last year and I put them in stocking stuffers and the people that got them actually really liked them. But I think I'm going to make um, notepads for next year. Like uh, this summer, oh geez. Like, ugh, all year I can look for notepads that will fit. Hopefully flatten. Oh, look at how bent these are. I didn't even notice that. I have to bend those all out. But they're such cute designs. Yeah, these are totally bent. Hmm. I'd have to see if I can exchange them. But look at how cute the designs are. And, like, I could just put something over the bottom and just make little notepads for them. So, I wonder why that got so stuck in there. It's really weird. So we will, hopefully I can exchange those because they're pretty bent up. And I, the first box was really bad. And then that was, oops, the only one that they had left. And then these are super cute for cards. Isn't that cute? Like you could put a sticker over that and that, or some washi tape, whatever. So I think these will be fun, cute. 
Yeah, so that's that. And then get those back in there. And then I found apple and cinnamon. They only had the soaps, the bar soaps left. And I don't know that they had all of it. They did have um, Bath Fizzy box, but the box was had something else in it. Like it had emptied out and they put something else in. But I've heard that there's cranberry, so I found the apple cinnamon. And it smells delish. Then I found yeah, a little bit of washi tape. They had the princesses from Disney. And I have a frozen cricket, um, so I thought I'd use, I think some of them are on here. Well, if not, whatever. And then the Tsum Tums, which are really cute. Aren't they cute? Those are really cute. So I just grabbed those. They also had cars and I think, not Spider-Man, but some Transformer maybe. But I didn't get those. Then I found these. They've got push pins and also bulldog clips in this copper. And then these cool little, almost like musical notes, but not. And so that is my hauls. Um, but thanks for watching. And let me know what you like best. Like what is your favorite out of all this? Specifically, probably the Christmassy stuff, because I think their designs are just so awesome. Um, but let me know down below in the comments what your favorite thing is. And thanks for watching. Bye.